Now, this is a historic time for CASIS. This is our first opportunity to actually send research to the International Space Station. This launch, it's, it's a culmination in a sense of a lot of hard work that's been made by our team, uh, but then also working alongside researchers that uh, are interested in utilizing the ISS for Earth benefit related research. So this particular launch of Orbital is of course new, it's its first flight, and it adds to our current uh, availability of the SpaceX vehicle, which provides our science up mass as well. It allows us to add more flights to station per year, which of course enables more research, and so it's really, really critical to the success of the research portfolio of, of the station program. The partnership between CASES and NASA is a critical one because CASES' job is to go and bring innovative and new users to space station. In 2010, I created the Student Spaceflight Experiments Program, and we're here because under, the, under that program, we've got 23 experiments designed by student flight teams flying on Orb 1. CASIS has been a remarkable partner. Because of CASIS support, about 6,000 students have been fully immersed in microgravity experiment design for this mission. For me personally, it was terrific to watch the kids because you can kind of see that spark in their eye and how excited they are to be in an environment like this, to, to be here and know that their research is going to go to the International Space Station. We had to design an experiment that would go up into the International Space Station. We had to create a proposal and then submit that proposal to our school and then NASA chose the winner for our school. Which luckily yeah. was. Which luckily it was, was awesome. It's amazing how once information got out that we had the opportunity to send something to the International Space Station, our community just rallied behind us because they wanted us to be successful. Not many people can say they've been able to send something in space and so, especially a teenager. Five, four, three, two, one. We have ignition. We have lift off of the Antares vehicle for the Orb 1 mission while the flight facility delivering signals on its first commercial by service on the ISS. This launch signifies an incredible success. First, you have orbital sciences, you have NASA being involved, you have CASIS being involved. But then on top of that, the research that CASIS was able to broker on this launch. So you're talking about education, you're talking about academic institutions, you're talking about commercial companies, and you're just talking about great research going to the ISS in general. I mean, this is a huge success for everybody involved. Cygnus is uh, currently 30 meters and holding away from the International Space Station. As you can see here, the distance uh, not very far between the arm and Cygnus. And at 5.08 a.m. Central Time, that is capture confirmed of Cygnus in the Orbital 1 flight. Their vehicle has been successfully captured by the crew on board the International Space Station on this first official flight.